Hi, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is gonna be for Saggies, my Saggies. Whoop, whoop, Saggies. All right, let's see. This is gonna be week one. Week one. May 2021. All right, my little Saggies. Let's see, current scenario. Saggies, Queen of Swords, what he or she is feeling. What he or she is feeling. I had a tough shuffle like this with Leo in the same spot. Yeah, it's like, I don't know if you're letting go of a toxic situation. Um, there's a masculine here that wants to balance the scales out, okay? Tell me what uh, you don't see coming. Strength, injustice, so possible second chance, or you having to be real strong to make your own judgment call. Possible outcome. Seven of Cups, Four of Cups. So yeah, it, it's almost like you don't even want it. Don't take something because you're bored. Don't go back into a relationship because you're bored. Don't fall for someone's charm because you're bored. Current past. Two years ago, two weeks ago, two days ago. The sun. Bottom of the deck, yeah. You could be dealing with a Leo. But this is being unhappy and lonely and feel like you're missing out. Um, to me, it's like Leo energy. Because there's nothing happy. Nothing was growing. You're unhappy. So nine of cups reversed with the five of pence. Like something petty went down. I don't know if you saw long term, but it didn't pan out that way. So to me, you turn your back. You're coming in as a feminine. Tell me about current energy. Now, guys, I read by the depiction of the card, right? So, five of swords. So, n not in its reverse. So, it's, it's like fighting, arguing with the past, but you, like, you dropped it. Like, you cut it off, you know? Um, but this is somebody wanting to come back around to you. Or you like contemplating, do I walk away? Do I not? Again, unhappy. So how he or she is feeling, it looks like you got a masculine energy that is letting go of a situation, but wants to balance the scales here. Wants to fix something. But to me, yes, the emperor energy has no hope for a new start. You got a masculine that's like, hoping to fix something with you and you're just like no I'm done like this is bullshit you turn your back this is like seeing potential but then something happened and it's I don't know if you were partying but I, regardless you're unhappy something happens it was, and to me it's like petty turning your back not arguing like you're just like something with your past like no but then it's like upright this is you going towards something happier reverse it's like do I want to walk away do I not but to me you already turned your back so it's not completely over so I don't know if you're dealing with this person but this person is letting go of something that looked toxic or fear and they want to fix something but they feel like there's no hope when it comes to a new start be dealing with an Aries Leo so the energy is calmer than what the other two I just saw so let's see what you don't see coming it's almost like there's a second chance coming yes yeah, so you know something's gonna be revealed and um, somebody could be in love with somebody else 
because this is mutual. It's almost like the second chance is going to, to someone else, so you got to stay strong here. So everything, in every single fire sign, it's like something's being revealed. So if there was a family dynamic or something, ten of pens reverse, it's like no second chance. Somebody fell in love with somebody else. Possible outcome. So don't don't go after something because you're bored. Possible outcome. Yeah, it's like a new start, really having to go within, being confident to go after something. So it's almost like you have something new here. If someone's coming at you, a new job, something like don't give up on yourself. Don't go backwards. Don't consider taking an offer out of boredom. Maybe just work on you. Don't try to fix something right now. Go within. Take care of you. So even if this is you right now, it's like shut down communication. <clears throat> or something's being revealed with all fire signs. Okay. Um, multiple people, uh, I'm not really sure. You got Leo Aries, so strong here. Coming in cold, having the strength. There's no second chance. Um, there's, there's, there's new love and it's going to be exposed. Okay. But the, the one that's leaving a toxic situation, um, doesn't have much hope is hoping to balance something out. So I think it's linked, but it basically is kind of telling me it's like over with you guys, but not quite over with you. Cause you're still like, Oh, so the, your past is going to come back and it's going to leave you in a situation where you're going to have to like really think about this. And this is saying, don't just take an offer. You know, just don't, just don't give in because you're bored. All right. Spirit's saying like, you really got to go within and what is best for you? Like, honestly, soul search. Do you, do you really want this? Or is somebody hitting you up right now because they're bored? Because I'm telling you right now, Aries is not losing, learning a lesson in that Aries read. And you have him here again, if it's all linked. Something's being exposed. All you fire is being exposed this week. Okay. So. Tell me about this Eight of Cups real quick. Reverse. Yeah. See, it's still somebody who's not putting an effort in. Just wants in and out. Somebody's going to come in quick, but not really put the effort in. You know? So I don't know if they're going to be like, I'm going to put the effort in. But it's like, you know better. So right now, this week, I'm telling you, like, there's just something where it's like, yeah, see, I'm telling you, there's just something this week where it's, it's just like, it's not a win, okay? They're just kind of like keeping an eye on you. Nothing's moving. Nothing's moving forward this week. So you got to let this energy subside. You don't know how hard it was to let you go. So... So many things remind me of you. Yeah, so somebody really, I don't know if there's a destined scenario somewhere. It's just the way everything is going down is so shitty, okay? Um, well, this is you, like, having a really hard time letting this go. This is this person. Like, it was really hard to let you go. But I, I'm going elsewhere, you know? And it's like still focused on the past here. And there's there's new love. So honestly, please do what's best for you. I can't stress that enough. Go within. Where are your morals, your standards, your boundaries, your integrity, your confidence? You don't need to be treated like this. You don't, you're not leftovers in a fridge. What do I eat? What do I taste? You're not second best. You're not a pence. Okay. Whew. Tough to go for fire this week. Sad. not everyone else's fault it's yours all right so 
You're a grown-ass adult. Stop blaming other people on other shit. So, again, you're dealing with somebody who's not owning their own shit. Okay? So, worry about yourself. I love you guys. I hope this helps. I'll see you over on Patreon. Bye, guys. Love you.